Rothamsted Research, previously known as the Rothamsted Experimental Station and then the Institute of Arable Crops Research, is one of the oldest agricultural research institutions in the world, having been founded in 1843. It is located at Harpenden in the English county of Hertfordshire and is a registered charity under English law. One of the station's best known and longest running experiments is the Park Grass Experiment, a biological study that started in 1856 and has been continuously monitored ever since. History The Rothamsted Experimental Station was founded in 1843 by John Bennett Laws, a noted Victorian-era entrepreneur and scientist who had founded one of the first artificial fertilizer manufacturing factories in 1842, on his 16th century estate, Rothamsted Manor, to investigate the impact of inorganic and organic fertilizers on crop yield. Appointing a young chemist, Joseph Henry Gilbert, as his scientific collaborator, Laws launched the first of a series of long-term field experiments, some of which still continue. Over 57 years, Laws and Gilbert established the foundations of modern scientific agriculture and the principles of crop nutrition. In 1902 Daniel Hall moved from Y College to become director, taking a lower salary to join an establishment lacking money, staff, and direction. Hall decided that Rothamsted needed to specialize and was eventually successful in obtaining state support for agricultural research. In 1912 E. John Russell, who had come from Y in 1907, took over as director until 1943, overseeing a major expansion in the 1920s, when Sir William Gammy Ogg took over until 1958 and increasing the number of staff from 140 to 471 and creating new biochemistry, nematology, and pedology departments. Topic: Statistical Science. Many distinguished scientists have been associated with Rothamsted. In 1919, Russell hired Ronald Fisher to investigate the possibility of analyzing the vast amount of data accumulated from the classical field experiments. Fisher analyzed the data and stayed to create the theory of experimental design, making Rothamsted a major center for research in statistics and genetics. Among his appointments and successors in the statistics department were Oscar Irwin, John Wishart, Frank Yates, William Cochrane and John Nelder. Indeed, many consider Rothamsted to be the most important birthplace of modern statistical theory and practice. Partly through these methods, researchers at Rothamsted have made significant contributions to agricultural science, including the discovery and development of systemic herbicides and pyrethroid insecticides, as well as pioneering contributions to the fields of virology, nematology, soil science and pesticide resistance. During World War II, aiming to increase crop yields for a nation at war, a team under the leadership of Judah Hirsch Quastel developed 2,4-D, still the most widely used weed killer in the world. <laughs> Recent history In 1987, Rothamsted, the Long Ashton Research Station, and Broome's Barn Experimental Station merged to form the Institute of Arable Crops Research 
The Long Ashton Research Station was closed in 2002, with some of its staff moved to Rothamsted, whilst Broom's Barn is operated as an experimental farm for Rothamsted. Rothamsted is now operated by a grouping of private organizations under the name of Rothamsted Research and is mainly funded by various branches of the UK government through the Biotechnology and Biological Sciences Research Council and Department for Environment, Food and Rural Affairs DEFRA. Rothamsted Research supports around 350 scientists including 50 visiting scientists, 150 administrative staff and 60 PhD students, as well as the Rothamsted site Rothamsted Research operates Broom's Barn, a 120-hectare experimental farm near Bury St Edmunds, Suffolk, which is the UK's national centre for sugar beet research. North White, 250 hectares 620 acres of grassland near Oakhampton, Devon. It provides a «farm platform» allowing research teams to conduct experiments on 325 hectare 62 acre mini farms it was formerly part of the institute of grassland and environmental research its research program has four main areas 2020 wheat increasing wheat productivity to yield 20 metric tons per hectare in 20 years from the current 9 tons per hectare in 2012 cropping carbon optimizing carbon capture by grasslands and perennial energy crops such as willow designing seeds improved health and nutrition through seeds Delivering sustainable systems, investigating sustainable agricultural systems to increase productivity while minimizing environmental impact, it also operates The Insect Survey, two national networks for monitoring insect populations in the UK. Phi Base, a database of multiple pathogen host interactions. GM protest In 2012 Rothamsted started testing genetically modified wheat which had been modified to produce an aphid alarm pheromone produced by aphids when under attack to help deter pests. This trial attracted criticism from anti-GM groups and about 200. People attempted to occupy the site on 27 May 2012. They were prevented by a large police presence and the protest ended peacefully. However one protester did trespass and damage the crop. The protester was later arrested, tried and fined £4,000. A video appeal by scientists at Rothamsted led to over 6,000 people signing a don't destroy research. Petition organized by Sense About Science. Sense About Science also organized a question and answer session with scientists. The author Mark Linus commented that Rothamsted's successful campaign may be a turning point for GMOs. The results published in 2015 showed that the trial wheat variety was no better than standard wheat varieties in deterring pests. Topic: <laughs> People associated with Rothamsted Topic Directors John Bennett Laws, eighteen forty three to nineteen hundred Alfred Daniel Hall, nineteen oh two to nineteen twelve E. John Russell, nineteen twelve to nineteen forty three William Gammy Og, nineteen forty three to nineteen fifty eight 
Frederick Charles Baden (1958–1972), Leslie Fowden (1973–1988), Kenneth Treharn (1988–1989), Trevor Lewis (1989–1993). Benjamin J. Mifflin, nineteen ninety four to nineteen ninety eight Ian R. Crute, nineteen ninety nine to two thousand nine Maurice Maloney, twenty ten to twenty thirteen Akim Doberman, twenty fourteen Topic Entomologists Carrington Bonsor Williams, Augustus Daniel I. M. M. S. Colin Butler. Topic: Environmental meteorologists. John Monteith, Howard Penman. Topic. Botanists Winifred Brenchley, Mary Dillis Glynn, plant pathologist, F. M. L. Sheffield, Catherine Warrington. Topic: Chemists and biochemists. Edward Mortimer Crowther George W. Cook Joseph Henry Gilbert Judah Hirsch Quastel Norman Pierisum of the chemists associated with Rothamsted can be found by searching on Rothamsted on the Biographical Database of the British Chemical Community, 1880–1970. Topic: Statisticians. Ronald Fisher, statistician, evolutionary biologist, eugenicist, and geneticist. Oscar Irwin. John Wishart. Frank Yates. William Cochran. John Nelder. Robert Wedderburn. Frank Anscombe. Topic: <inaudible> Geologists and soil scientists. John Cat. Topic: <inaudible> 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 See also. Long-term experiment. GenStat, a statistical package originally developed at Rothamsted Research, which is reflected in its capacity to handle complex block designs of the type likely to occur in agricultural multi-treatment experiments. <laughs>